Federal Hawking headed into Tuesday night against Waterford in control of its own destiny in the TBC Hawking. The Lancers struggled to hit shots in the first half, but their defense allowed them to keep their lead throughout. That propelled them to go into the half up 33-15. Head coach Jonathan Thompson talks about how his team was able to get over the shooting slump. Yeah, I just kept telling him, I said, nights we have that where our offense is not flowing, we've got to step up and we've got to get stops, and we were able to do that pretty well in the, in the first half. Um, second half, we got a little lazy sometimes on our defense and was giving up open shots and putting them on the line. That message helped the Lancers find their groove in the second half. One area that shined for them, rebounding. Yeah, our rebounding was actually really good tonight. I was, I was impressed the way the kids were boxing out. Um, they were doing the little fundamental things of making sure that they had contact each and every time. So I, I'm very pleased with our, our especially Aiden and Scotty underneath. They did a very good job of battling on the boards. That battle helped them pull away from the Wildcats en route to a 77-49 victory. With the win, Federal Hawking takes the TBC Hawking Conference crown outright. Thompson talks about what that means for his team. Well, it means a lot to us. This is one of our, I mean, preseason goals that we talked about that we wanted to accomplish. Um, and we honestly got it a lot sooner than what I was expecting to. Um, testament to the way the boys have handled themselves, the way they play, they work both in games and in practice. I'm, I'm very proud of our team. Uh, to back to back, like years wise, it, was, it feels very good. Just uh, the way we're playing, it just as a team makes us feel good. The Lancers now look ahead to their matchup with Trimble Friday night as they hope to extend their 17 game win streak. Reporting for Arbut Heroes, I'm Maria Manessi, reminding you to be heroic.